eat the food which is rich in purins so high protein diet these crystals gets deposited in the different parts of our body hi viewers this is dr aditya somayaji senior consultant orthopedic surgeon foot and ankle surgery specialist so now we'll speak about something called as grade 2 pain and uric acid often people are coming to me nowadays with a lot of pain in their grade 2 or one side of which suddenly starts suddenly starts swollen suddenly gets painful overnight the patient comes to us with lot of pain in the toe especially the great toe so whenever we see that patients you know most of the surgeons or most of the doctors what they order is something called as uric acid so what is this uric acid why does it cause this great toe pain so let us discuss something or let us think about some kind of uric acid metabolism or uric acid what does it to the body see uric acid is some kind of a metabolite or a extra product that is formed during our metabolic process or during the process in the body the problem with this uric acid is in our body and our system we don't have a good mechanism to discrete excrete or spill off this uric acid from our body unlike other toxins where liver can do a job kidney can do the job our skin can do the job like that uric acid is a pro, is a is a product which cannot be easily expelled from the body we don't have a separate system we don't have a separate enzyme or whatever it is to break it down and spill it unlike our lower animals which has this enzyme so uric acid tends to accumulate in the body when you have a, some specific problems so there are some problems where you have inherently deficient in some kind of metabolic products which builds up the uric acid we have something a deficiency in kind of processing the uric acid and some people who which are, who are obese or overweight can will tend to accumulate uric acid because of the because of the these uh, metabolic pathways which i have told so once uric acid gets accumulated more than what we have in the body the they the uric acid produces something called a small crystals these crystals gets deposited in the different parts of our body these crystals gets deposited in the different bones and different joints and sometimes skin also so these depositions can cause severe pain in the foot especially in the great toe something called as gout so this gout can produce a severe pain in our great toe which will be enhanced by the our metabolic process so what kind of thing what should we do what which which problems or which what activities will increase this uric acid and what activities will uh, produce this pain first thing we have to remember that when you have a gout or hyper uh, uric acid increased uric acid we should follow some strict instructions this uric acid comes from something called as purins in the in our body which is a part of our protein in the body when you eat the food which is rich in purins so high protein diet can lead to increased uric acid in body as i told you it is difficult to excrete unless kidneys do some job they can't they can't get out from their body so they tend to deposit in the joints and cause pain so avoid very high protein rich foods and also avoid fasting don't fast don't fast fasting will break down the fat and all and produce more uric acid and also don't feast if you go if you eat more the more protein comes in and it comes to it it produces uric acid which is difficult to spill as i told you and which leads to a lot of pain in the foot and the great toe so these things should be avoided dairy can be taken so we can selectively take some foods which should be avoided completely and other foods can be taken normally and if you don't follow these instructions this can lead to severe hyperuric acid and cause severe pain and also there is some good medication nowadays which can control the uric acid completely improving your body weight or losing the body weight is extremely important if you have a hyperlipidemia or cholesterol this can also cause uric acid accumulation so you have to control your cholesterol and lipids use the proper medication for that weight control taking a lot of water can help in uh sending the uric acid out so these are the main things that can be done to prevent gout and if you are already diagnosed with gout to control the uric acid we have to follow these medications and some kind of lifestyle changes to prevent the 
ஃப்ரீக்வெண்ட் எபிசோட்ஸ் தேங்க்யூ